This is cicada, one of the most amazing insects in the world. Emerges every year from the ground in billions of numbers. Some species emerges periodically, such as a species called Magicicada subtandacim emerges every 17 years. Cicadas are harmless, never bites or stings. In fact, they are a healthy protein rich snack. Best known for the loud sounds they make. Today, in this episode, we will see how they make this ear splitting sound. First, let's take a brief look at its life cycle. After mating, female cicada lays eggs. She has a body part called ovipositor. With the help of this, she makes a groove on the twig or branch of the tree and lay eggs, which looks like a small rice grain. After two to seven months, depending upon the species, nymphs emerges from the egg, falls to the ground, tunneling to reach the suitable plant root and feed on the sap of the plant. They spend most of their lives as a nymphs and molds several times. At opportune time, they appear from the ground in enormous numbers, walks like zombies and finds their way to tree trunks and branches. Here they will have their final molting cycle and comes out with the wings. Flies to the most vantage points on the trees. Some of them becomes food for the birds, squirrels, raccoons, monkeys, etc. The others start looking for the partners for mating and male cicadas start singing to attract females. The voice is so loud, a species called Tibican Vulcari can create 108 decibel loud alarming call from 50 centimeters and it is more than standing in a city traffic. Now let's see how actually they make this sound. Cicadas has body part called timbles on each side of its abdomen. Timbles are made of a thin membrane. This membrane connects some thicker linings known as ribs. From the inside, these timbles are connected with the timble muscles. These muscles contract to pull timbles inside, buckling the ribs inside. As each rib buckles, it makes a clicking sound. Simultaneously, all ribs create a series of clicks in one contract action and then again when muscles release timbles. This series of clicking sounds emerges from both the timbers and both the sounds overlap each other. So at the peak of the sound wave, when two waves overlap, it creates a booming effect resulting in the loudest possible sound and it's just a single series of clicks. It happens 300 to 400 times per second and with the help of abdomen and wings, the sound results in a loud chirping call. Thanks for watching.